creative. If women are waiting for years to get married, it's because the guy doesn't meet her requirements. Ling Ling will never <laughs> say, never marry that guy. 304s need Jesus. Yeah. You know what's funny? You seem so innocent. Yeah, I know. We showed your Instagram, which could be just like, you know, pictures or whatever. Why'd you say, yeah, I know, like that? You like, backed him up so fast. It's Because like, like, it, it, your name is Succubus, and you're talking about being a Christian. <laughs> the fuck? That makes no crazy. sense. Oh, her name is Succubus? Yes. yes. Her name is literally that Succubus. That is not my name. That's my Instagram Chris, handle. Chris, that real quick. Again? Again? Listen. You were exposed. Because these girls are devious out here. Like, they really yeah, just bro, be they're, like, they're innocent, but they're, I'm they're not. I'm on my virgin. knees, Stacey. I'm on my knees. I don't understand, like... Wait, wait yeah. what's what's what's, what's the problem? Is, he, is she a virgin? Well, the problem is that your name is Digital Succubus, and that's what you are. So why would you name yourself that? I just because it was originally Sasuke's baby, baby mama, mama and okay, but why'd I got you pick a lot digital of succubus? Because it was originally Sasuke's baby mama, and a lot of people Sasuke? don't like Sasuke. Yeah, She's got a picture of Jackie. Well, what's Chan the right? reason why it's, why'd you <laughs> pick that? It's actually a really cool photo. I love that photo. What? What's the reason that you picked that besides that? You could pick anything. I was just trying to get creative. I don't I know. Think that's I thought great... it was a weird name too, but it came up in like the little randomizing thing. I gotta ask this yeah. real quick. How many girls on the panel think that they're wife material? Raise of hands if you think you are wife material on the panel. All the girls think they're wife. <laughs> you think Dubai is a country style? Uh, <laughs> do, do you? Do you? Do you? I'm a good person. Wait, wait, wait. Raise of hands again, one more time. Who here thinks they're wife material? Raise of hands. Not Everybody. Do this. Every girl. Everyone okay. Every girl here thinks they're a wife material. All right, Chris, you know what to do, nigga. All right, yeah. Let's play okay. a game, ladies. Yeah, we're going to play a game. Oh, Neon. Let's play. Sticka will be the judges. Yes. Oh, yeah. You tell us if they're wife material or not. Yep. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to pull up. Let's start with uh, Miss Men Can't Tell Me Nothing. Well, let's go uh, randomly because we don't know what the fuck their names are on IG. Yeah. Oh. Oh yeah! Oh, you don't know. Yeah, oh bro, shit! Like, who's who's the first? man, come on! Uh, yeah, 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 that is true. That is random. Yeah, I, don't I don't know. I don't know what that is. That is random as hell. I ain't gonna lie. Succubus. Yeah, being a virgin is crazy, bro. Right, so you uh, should be sucking, bro. All right, number one. All right, let's see who's up here. <laughs> <laughs> Can't even debate me. Okay, uh, Ariel Spring. Oh, that's Wait, you. What? Who this? Are Wait, that's, that's her. her. Who this? No, next to you, Chris. No, yeah, that's, that's her. Why are y'all asking who is that? She's right there. She's right here. Wait, where? No, that's not. That's her. Yes, that is. <laughs> That's you? Uh, yeah, my hair's down. Enough. Mike, please. Oh, you look way better on Instagram. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> see, I don't want to see Now you see what the fuck I go through? Okay. Neon and Sneeko? Holy. Okay, so Sneeko. Wait, Neon, look at, look oh, at that. I thought my creator got deleted. What, what the? Oh, my God. Yeah. Yeah. That's her. That's yeah. the girl you said was going to explode. Let me see your face. Yo. Oh, my fucking God. Yo, Neon, now you know what I go Isn't through, Isn't that man. crazy? I don't even blame you anymore, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that is fucking insane. Wait, like, press on one. Yeah, click one. Wow, bro. I, think I would DM her. her. Yeah, I know, bro. It should be illegal. How the bro? Fuck? You're just butt ass naked on bro. there too. What the fuck? Why are you naked? Can you That's that a here? nice picture, by the way. Yeah, people say Thank catfish, you. man. Yo, chat, Check man. The cakes. That's now you know. No, man. she looks fine. Yo, then like I said, you're li literally perfect. Literally. <laughs> yeah, yeah, simp. All right, uh, uh, Neon Sneeko, uh, would you guys rate this as uh, white material? Hell no, bro. Yes. What? Oh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Okay. I can't stand him. Yeah. I got you. I respect you. I got you. Right. Yeah, he got you. You just said she was going to explode at the beginning of the show. Yeah, but that felt bad. Yeah, I'm just lying to her face. Yeah, you're good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're good. Uh, All right. Okay, who's yeah, next? No. Um, yeah, I mean, dude, that is... Bro, bro. So you can be a little more conservative now. You know, like these modern women are in a relationship with Instagram instead of their man. Like it's it's crazy that that's why you think it's okay to like travel all over the world and do whatever Wait, you want. Hold on, is this? Why is, this? is it not okay that's to travel okay. the world and do what I want? Because you? Because I just went blonde recently. Because I got cheated on. <laughs> also, oh we just came from Fair yoga, guys. Like, oh, yeah, we did just come from we yoga. We haven't done Instagram our makeup delight, or bro. showered. Anything. Yo, y'all don't look like your fucking Instagram, Instagram delight, pictures, bro. bro. What the what fuck the is this, man? Y'all look way better on that. Bro, on I'm, bro. Telling Yo, right now, bro. I'm telling you right now. I'm telling you right now, What the hell? Oh, yeah. that? I look the same. That, Transformation. Does that not look like right? me? Bro. They look like, like I think yeah. it looks the like her. The only thing is that I'm blonde now, but Wait, like, click I one? just went blonde. Transformation, bro. Bro. <laughs> bro, chat, man. I'm telling you right now. Yo, it, hold it, on. Yeah, that yeah. doesn't look like you at all. That doesn't look like you, that man. That is like me? fucking Wait, insane. Man, uh, do you forgive me, man? Okay. Oh, God, I do. I was, uh, <laughs> that, that dude. That's... Look, look, someone in the comments, you are literally perfect again. This is what I'm saying. Why you think it's okay to travel? And that you are in a relationship with your comment section. That's who's giving you the same validation that Can you, you would get from a man. She's but you friend. said it's not okay to travel. Like it's not okay to travel. No, it's fine to travel, but you are supplementing a relationship with Instagram. Yo, chat. Okay, Come but on, Instagram pays me, and so don't you guys get paid from your what are you fucking getting, whatever like fucking you do? Five hundred a month. <laughs> no, <laughs> no. you got a brand deal for a lip gloss once. <laughs> like, I get free trips, whatever. Like I don't have to go into detail about what I do. Like to, I don't have to. Prove, really I don't have to prove anything, that, right? but. 
No, I mean, she can vouch for me. She it's just crazy that you would need to be in a relationship with a girl for years to get the same pictures that you're posting online for free. You covering up your titties and your nipples just public on the internet. I used to have to grind. Back in the day, back in middle school, I remember like sneakily showing like other people, like, yo, look what I got. You know? It and like now it's just public. You're, you're hurt by that. No, it's just, it's, it's alarming. <laughs> it's alarming. It's, it's, yeah, it sounds like it bothers you. Why does it bother you so much? Because it's destroying society in real time that you're able to date your phone instead of a guy. But like, what makes it so we're dating our phone? Like, how are we dating our phone? Instead of sending that picture to your husband, you're sending it to the internet. And that's something that's, that's like an intimate thing. And every, all the girls here are like retardedly gassing you up. Yeah, you look great. It's just a picture of your ass on the internet. I think it looks cute. Yeah, of it course does. it does. Yeah, but you art. used to have to work for that. That I used to be like yeah. for the guy that she's in love with. I get what you're saying. I see how you feel like, that. I feel that. It's art? Yeah. Your butthole's art? <laughs> okay. What the fuck are you well, talking about? I a photo of my butthole on It there. was literally was just body. a close-up picture I of your ass. I work hard for my body. I work out every day. I eat well. And so so if save I, it for your husband. But I don't have a husband, and I don't want a husband right now. But you're not going to cool. find a husband by making what should be for and your husband public. sometimes also, like, photos like that inspire people to work out and be healthy and live better lives. It inspires dudes to jerk off who are sipping for you in the comment section. I mean, that too, but I guess... Good for them. They're helping themselves. Well, it's not, it's not wow. helping. This is why, like, you think that I'm upset about it because it's making men weaker and it's making you all gassed up. And we're all going to have no kids in the end if we keep following this. They won. The people who design these social media companies won because now they are getting everything exclusive that should be for the your husband. Okay, but that's your that's your Opinion. like perspective. Yeah, I know you're going like... to go yap about this again, but yeah. Okay, can we see your Instagram, Colombian? Can we pull it up? We got to go around in order. So, so, so hold on, okay. the question is, is she white material, yes or no? <laughs> oh, absolutely not. Absolutely. Why? Her pictures are a bit better than hers, but I mean, yeah, I mean, still. you guys picked one photo that was like the only photo that I felt like kind of filtered, because all my other photos are pretty genuine, mm. and I don't post a lot of like myself. You don't edit your photos? No. You just literally said you filtered it, which that is That was editing. the one, and yeah, and like I said before, I went blonde because I got cheated on, so I was feeling really insecure about myself. So yeah, I'm gonna put a filter on there because I want to make sure that I look perfect and and no um, like. Uh, but that's available. our point: is that is that women a lot of times don't look like their pictures. Yeah, but online. look at the rest of the photos. Bro. Look at the rest of the photos. They're you look completely different now. I'm being like. Well, yeah, I'm, I just. Oh, how about not. this? Let me ask you this: What? How I would you feel if a guy told you? Um, just ask this scenario, this random scenario. You met a guy, you right? He was really attractive and charming, like and you fucked him, right? And then, okay. right? But you thought he was a lawyer. Then you find out that he actually works at Subway as a sandwich artist. What would you do? That's a pretty big difference. <laughs> it's a big difference. Yeah, that's a huge difference. How's that a big difference? That. that he's a lawyer. Yeah. You said you said you went to law school yeah. you said you are completely doing something that you're not even involved with so it's a problem you would feel deceived right okay so how is that not similar i mean a girl it, editing her photos it's not like i'm completely editing myself to the point where i'm unrecognizable he like, edited himself he's he's now he's a lawyer i mean well yeah but that's an extreme like you know if he would have like I don't know. Is it really uh, an extreme? Sub Subway and lawyer, yeah, that's a huge extreme. Okay, yeah, like, a re real life and Instagram, that's a big extreme. Right, but I mean, what on that picture is so extreme that it's it's yeah. not that I changed my eye color, I didn't change my hair color, I didn't change my body. Like, the only thing is that I literally used a filter that just... But what, what I'm saying is that it's okay for women to deceive men online, but if a man no, was... No, it's not okay for anyone to deceive anyone. But it's not deceiving to use a filter. It's not like... I'm not saying, like, you know, it's not the same as saying I, I, I'm a lawyer and I work at Subway. I used a fucking filter yeah. on a photo. It's yeah. not the it's same. Still, it's still a form of deception. How is it deceiving? Because you're changing and enhancing your look. The only thing that's changing is, like, blemishes which is exactly, on my face. But... Which is exactly what men are attracted to. So, like, if a man blemishes and, you know, but that's deceives you on his every, profession. Like, it's unrealistic for women to not have imperf any imperfections on their face at all. Okay. It's just unrealistic. But... Everybody so then why not just keep it real and not edit your photo? And then just like a guy keeps it real, tells you he's a sandwich artist. Yeah, I mean, I didn't edit the photo. I used both. Used see, the, filter, the, but... the point I'm trying to get at here is that deception by women is socially acceptable, but for men it's not. That's it's what I'm trying to illustrate acceptable. here. acceptable. I'm not saying I mean, deception is acceptable. I mean, men use filters too. I've seen it. <laughs> it's not. Do you think it... the same degree of men edit and touch up their photos to the same degree that women do? Come on. No, but I've not seen Not even it. close. I've but, seen it. I mean, That's men a minority pose in a men. way that makes them look yeah, more flattering. I've seen they, that, too. They flex the, their abs the when flexing. they post a photo, right? Mm -hmm. So it's, it's is that deception? Not yeah. really. 
Mm, well, I would argue that. But... Do you have a six pack twenty four seven? No, right. I mean, you know, you, lean, you post lean. yourself in in the in your best light. If but you're lean, you're lean. You're gonna have abs regardless. Deceptive. No, 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 not always. But women edit their photos full on. Like that's. Oh well, yeah, I mean that's deception. This depends on to the extent that you're editing your photos, but I mean tweaking it a little bit, like okay. posing for a photo or flexing for a photo, is not Listen, the same bro, as. She's a lot. This is crazy. Bro. She's Aged like it's fine. ten years. Yeah. Okay. No, I, it just it just. Man, you gotta stop beating the dead horse, bro. These are the ends. You're never bro, gonna like, fucking. Yeah, like, yeah, like, I agree. Okay. God right. damn. What's up next? Who, who's next? Lilith. That's me. Is that you? That's me. What the fuck? That's you. Too Don't bad, try me. No, see, I'm, <laughs> I'm confirming. Uh, uh, that's me. Okay. Is she? Yeah, that's that, that, okay. Hey, that one, that one might change your mind. <laughs> it didn't change my mind. <laughs> no, I'm saying that might make you not think I'm white material because my booty cheeks are showing in that one. She looks right. kind of the same. Sneeko, uh, oh, yeah, neon. She, yeah, she does. White material or no? Uh, no. To be fair, she's working in yes. that. Like, that's work. Can you say why, Sniggo? That's her job. Because you're... You have a kid? I just, I said... She said the... oh. you, have a, you have a kid? Nice. No, thanks. Oh, really? Oh, well, yeah, that too. Do you think, so you don't, you don't think a woman should give up her modeling job once she gets a man? No, if that's how she makes money, I mean, just, yeah, if we're going to go OnlyFans, modeling is different, but modeling as in, like, catwalk is, you know, you can make good money in that. Yeah, I know, I'm wife material, passionate about but I'll it. take it. Huh? I mean, yeah, you have your yeah, ass cheeks out. Isn't the same shit. Yeah, you you have bikini a models. I mean, that's bikini models. <laughs> like, isn't it? Hold on, hold on. Most kids. models don't make any money. Wait man. a second. Wait a second. Thousand. She just snapped and said, "Y'all know I'm white material." You have a child. Yes. That's not wife material. That's so weird. Why do I want to play someone else's saved game? <laughs> oh shit. Okay, that's different. When I buy a video oh, game, I'm oh. not buying it used. Okay, I, I want to start it fresh. Person. Like when you get GTA, I'm not. I don't yeah, want to play yeah. halfway through the mission. Fair enough. Shit. But as a person. I'm not good. I mean, you're you a person. Understand. That, you don't understand. No, I do understand. You're a person that comes with another person. It comes. True. Got it? I wouldn't want that either, but I'm still white material. You can't delete your kid, so I mean, it's pack, package deal. I mean, deal. For, yeah. true. You package can't. deal. I wouldn't want no man with another kid either, so uh, fair enough. So what do you? So fair what am I? Fair enough. <laughs> oh, okay. So you're okay. not white material. No, I am. No, to you're who? Not. To guys that want. I guess to my baby daddy. All right, cool. That's yeah. not your husband, though. Do you That's still a... talk wait, wait, wait. But he will be. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Go Wait, ahead. so he doesn't want to commit to you, or you don't want to commit to him? I'm I, confused here. Listen, there is, this is a long story, but it, it's on my time. It's oh, she time. don't want to commit to him. Yeah, I have patience, though. <laughs> oh, no, he doesn't. I mean, you got no choice. Wait. It, okay, listen, so it, if I'm so confused. he's very, he's very young-minded. He's still fucking he's, other bitches. No, not like that. He just can't control his anger, and I don't like... Random attitudes. I'm mature. I mean, he enough. might be angry because you're on the internet Would showing you get your body mad off. About that? Would you get mad at that? It's, it's completely unacceptable for a woman to sexualize herself when she has a man. Period. You think I'm being like sex, like sexual with it? I just saw your did ass. You not, and did you not just see yeah, yourself yeah, yeah. On, on, on? No, you? but like you think I'm being slutty? Uh, yeah. Yes. I, and this is the problem, right? So, so a lot of women don't understand that men have a serious issue with their girl being on the internet, being naked. Like it's not acceptable behavior. Okay. Like, it's just not. Like, think about it this way. What if your guy, how about this? What if your guy took care of three other girls, but he wasn't giving you money and taking care of the, you and the kid? What would you do? I'd be upset. You'd be pissed off, right? Because he's sharing his resources with other women? Mm -hmm. That's how men feel about you being on the internet parading your body around. Fair You're enough. sharing your resources with the whole world. Fair enough. That's, that's our issue with it. Yeah. And that's what I was trying to explain to you. I know you're like, oh, well, no one can control me, blah, blah, blah. It's not about control. It's about being in control of what goes on because women can absolutely destroy a man's reputation. I mean, look at uh, Jonathan Majors right now. His chick wanted to act like an idiot and all this other shit. He was telling her, yo, I need you to be a, a good girl by my side. I'm a great man, blah, blah, blah. Women can tarnish kingdoms. Like, look at Will Smith. Got embarrassed from his girl being a whore. That's... <laughs> no, it's true. It's true. Jada's terrible. Yeah. But that's like... You're not talking. Are you? I'm, I'm no, to, no, no, no. Suck Jaden Tupac? Tupac? I'm, Tupac? I'm, I'm trying to illustrate. No, I'm trying to illustrate how a woman's behavior has direct <laughs> implications on her man's status. Does that make sense? So if a woman dresses provocatively or acts in a certain way, she can fuck her man's reputation and status up. So I'm trying to let you ladies know the way you behave is very important for men. Like I know you're saying a man can't control me, blah, blah, blah. Well, then you don't deserve a man because you're supposed to be under a man's authority and leadership. 
men and women are not equal. Misogyny. And you know deep down that you don't want a guy that's going to sit there and like let you be the boss, let you pay for the bills, go off of what you think. No, you probably want a guy that's a leader, that's charismatic, that's charming, that can, you know, c- carry a conversation and be a leader. Unless you want a guy to, that's egalitarian. You want an egalitarian relationship? No. I mean, no. I want, I want a masculine man. For okay. Your... So do you think masculine men are going to want you to parade your body on the internet? Um, yeah. I think the a secure profound, man. No. I think a secure man. <laughs> I've dated man. guys when I've been doing what I'm doing now, posting bikini photos, whatever, and they're chill with it. And they're secure, strong men. And they're gone. Yeah, they're gone. Yeah, and there's no they're relationship. They're other girls. Yeah. Yeah. No, yeah. That's yeah. not what happened. Bro, they're but... gone, bro. So here's the thing. A, a, a component of masculinity is being able to deal with people and have hard conversations that might hurt other people's feelings and tell the truth. A truly masculine guy is not going to want his girl to be all over the internet parading her body. Sorry. Like, masculine men typically are more conservative and traditional. Traditional men don't want modern day women that aren't traditional in return. It's not okay, a fair well, maybe deal. Maybe I want a masculine man who's not traditional. That doesn't that's, make that, sense. That's, not a that's like saying I'm a smart retard. It doesn't make sense. <laughs> I've, I think everyone has, like I said before, it's They're not black and white and everyone has a different way of living. There are men out there who are masculine, who are secure, and will be okay with you posting bikini Can photos. Can you name one example of a guy like that? My ex. Why is do you see do you hear yourself? Because I moved back to America and do you he was hear, in New like, Zealand. Do you hear the words coming up? Okay. It was it wasn't anything crazy. So if you didn't like him then clearly if you left New Zealand when you could have been with him. I liked him, but not enough. Yeah, it just Our wasn't goals. the right match. But it wasn't because of that. It was other things. Oh my god. There's stuff that there there's missing stuff here. The foundation was shaky anyway, so Yeah, I mean uh, bro, it, look. Women can say whatever they want to say, but guys don't want their girl parading their body all over the internet. And it's amazing to me that I even have to explain this, but so many girls, like, because, because, well, men don't, aren't honest about it because they, you get say the stuff that you guys said, you're insecure, toxic, oh. It's like, no, I just don't want my girl showing her body all over the internet. Like, that's fucking weird. Um, I have a question for you. Do you think, you said you don't like being, like, micromanaged, right? Yeah. Do you think if a man micromanages you, does it have to always come across as micromanaging or if he just cares for you? Maybe that's why. Uh, I mean, showing. like, give me an example. Like, it let's depends. say he, you go out and he's like, OK, you can go out, but can you wear something that's not that scandalous? Maybe he's protecting you from, you know, other sick minded people. And you might take it think. as. <laughs> but the thing is, is like, I'm single now. I have no man. I go out like that and I'm fine. No. So if a man all of a sudden comes into my life and says, I can't wear that, but I've been wearing it this whole time. No, if you're in a relationship. Because he says, oh, you're not going to be safe. Dude, I've been safe this whole time without you in my life wearing this shit. So what are you saying? Theoretically, if you're in a relationship, if he said that, do you always think it's because he's trying to control you or protect you? I feel like it depends on the person. Like, I don't know. Some men are more controlling and some men might be a little bit more protective. I mean, depends on the guy. I don't know. Okay. Yeah. See, this is why you got to protect women from themselves, man. Like, yo, like it, I, with all due respect, women do dumb shit that hurts the relationship all the Stupid. time. Dressing provocatively, going out on girls' nights out, etc. The reason why your guy tells you, hey, I prefer you stay home, etc., is because they're trying to protect the relationship. They care about you when they put boundaries on you. If they don't give a fuck about you, they let you do whatever. Oh, yeah, you want to go ahead and I, hang out with Tom? Fine, you want to go with your girlfriends? You want to go to Cancun and party? That's when they don't give a fuck about you. Or... They're pussies and they don't have the balls to tell you this is inappropriate behavior for yeah. a woman that's in a relationship. I, I yeah, actually, that's the whole point of a relate. Like, why even be in a relationship with him then? That's why I'm not in a relationship that's right why now. Because she's single. <laughs> I can't find a guy who's secure and will let me also do what I want. Well, <laughs> you said you're picky, right? So you want a guy that has their shit together, whatever. You understand that these men are going to have requirements and standards just like you do, right? Yeah, but so, maybe I'm just not looking for that kind of man who's going to be telling me that I can't wear certain things out. That's what masculinity is, keeping your yeah. girl in check, though. Yeah. You said know. you want a masculine man. A cornerstone of masculinity is being able to put your woman in her place because women do dumb shit all the time. That compromises relationships. Okay, but men do dumb shit, too. It's both ways. The difference like is this. If I go fuck another chick, I will come back to you. You're my woman. If you go fuck another guy, it's over. Yeah. Do you not understand that? That men and women are not the same when it comes that's to sexuality. Hip- I don't agree. That's hip- that's hypocritical. Well, so you can like if I was in a relate, so you could go yeah. cheat on your woman, but yeah. your woman, but your woman can't cheat on you. Yes. 
So well, here's the thing. I'm saying, agree. I'm saying, I don't agree with that. look, 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 you don't have to agree with it. I'm just saying I men mean, are more capable of cheating and it not hurting the relationship. Does that make sense? I'm not saying it's right or wrong, but what no. I am saying is that I have a man who I have I know men I have friends whose man cheated and it's completely destroyed the relationship completely because he lied to the woman because he lied or the trust. because it happened he compromised the trust but I'll tell you this he still loves that girl the same yeah but it doesn't matter because how can she ever love him but the point I'm trying Fact. to make is a man his love for his woman doesn't change for having sex with another chick. Yeah. But if a woman fucks another guy, it's a wrap. You've already been checked out with that guy. You think yep. that changes her love for him? What do you mean? If she has sex with another man, that changes her love? Yep. Yes. Yeah. A woman I cannot... agree. If you're with a man that you... Okay, well, let me ask you this. You were in a relationship for six months, right? <laughs> yep. Did you fuck other guys while you were with him? No. Nope. Why not? Why not? Gotcha, bitch. Why? Because I was in a relationship. Oh. oh. But you can do it though, right? You can Why do didn't it you? Though. Right, but I made a commitment to oh. someone. Let me ask you a better question then. Did you want to fuck other guys? Did I want to? No, honestly, no. Why? Okay. Here's the difference between men and women. I guarantee you, which he actually did. <laughs> he wanted to fuck other girls though. And he did. Yeah. And he did. Yep. Because men and women are not the same. And it doesn't change your love for the girl. People do that. Right. Men and women yep. are not the same, but at the end yeah. of the day, if you commit to something oh, and you are in a committed relationship, oh, I think man. the respect should go both ways. I he should have been honest with you. Yeah, should have. But all I'm saying, I'm making the it's argument real. that men are capable yeah. of doing it. That's it's what I'm saying. Because you're trying to say hypocrisy, blah, blah, blah. Well, men and women aren't equal. I mean, look, you got a bunch of... Do you think... Okay, let's... How about this? Do you think you would make the amount of money that you do right now if I put you in a man's body? Mm. The answer is no. And the reason why is because you're a female and you're able to get certain opportunities based on the fact that you're a woman. So that clearly points to the fact that men and women are not equal and women have certain opportunities that men don't. But men also have other opportunities that women don't have. Such as? Such as they can make more money in other workplaces. <laughs> and, and how so? Why, why, because why because the they're a man. They don't get pregnant. They don't have to take leave. Um, they, pregnancy is a choice. Yeah, but you guys are just saying that women should always like want to have kids. Yeah, it's a choice. But it's still a choice, though. You're choosing yeah, not to do it, right? But, but most women have kids, yeah? Most? Yeah. Yeah. But, but, so the, the, but that's go. a choice. But that's a choice. choice. So, but it's a choice not just for a woman, but also for her husband. Look, well, who's taking the burden? You're, you're, trying to, you're trying to deflect. The point I'm simply making here is that men and women aren't equal. Oh, that's true. If I put you in a man's body, you would not make as much money as you do right now because... You're making money based solely on the fact that you're a female, okay? So what I'm trying to say is that men and women aren't equal at all. Your I own career that, choice shows that. I agree that. with that part. Okay, yeah, men and women. so then since we're not equal and you have certain opportunities that I don't, guess what? I have certain opportunities that you don't. That means if I fuck other girls, it's not the same as you fucking other guys because life is on easy mode for you as a female. That's the truth. I have 2023. a question I don't for you, Fresh. You don't agree that men have to work harder than women? No, women have to work harder to get the things that men do. What do you mean? Yeah. By that? What do you mean? Women don't have the same opportunities that men have. Really? Name one uh, one right or privilege that men have that women don't. Men don't have, they don't have to be on birth control. That's a choice. That's a choice. <laughs> yeah, but, yeah, but women are the one who, but who you are, have 30 we're different, the ones getting on. You want to talk about birth control? Women have like 30 plus options for birth control. We don't have any. Yeah, but... Women are the one that has to take birth control. They don't have to. It's a choice. I'm asking you yes, name one. but if they're wanting to be one sexually privilege active, or right that men have that wanting, women don't. Also, I feel like can't men, name anything. Neil, I, would you cheat on your girl? Never. I haven't even thought about it once. I wouldn't, bro. It's fucked up. Good man. Not all men cheat. I'm actually I'm a really nice guy, bro. It's not. I can't see it. Can you? It's not normal. You don't see it. No, I'm just kidding. That was bad. Okay, okay, let's move on. You, wait, uh, wait, you actually you've never thought about cheating? Never. All those well, parties. Blonde. I swear to God, not once, bro. What about blonde? No. It's weird, bro. I'm like attached. It's like I don't know. What You're sexually controlled, like as in you have sexual control. Well, he's a virgin. That's why. Yeah. So good job. Which he has sex. What's yeah, gonna happen they'll then? Change. Yeah. They'll change. You're gonna want to have more. Yeah. And more and more. But you're doing good so far. How many bodies do you have? That's not important. <laughs> Life is important. Let's move on. I think Fresh is pushing like four <laughs> some more, uh, Instagrams here. Nice dog. Ali Ki Hewitt. Hi. Okay, Who that's that? uh, Miss UK. <laughs> I don't think okay. she's a catfish. Oh, you look way better. Is she wife material? I look better on pictures. Yeah, you look like Emily Radikowski there. Oh, she looks, okay. she looks like it's a bad thing. Life. Life. Good thing. Yeah. You look uh, that's an amazing thing. Bad. Okay. Do you run all your pictures by your man before you post them? He takes most of them, to be fair. Okay. <laughs> that's good. Okay. All right. Wife material or no? 
Um, it's not that bad. I mean, go back again. You're like you're not showing uh, any. Let me say this real quick. Pro tip: If I were you, ask your man before you post any picture on the internet. Yeah. You should do it. Yeah. I show him what I'm gonna post. He's all right. Well, run it by him it. first. Well, I mean, here's where this question kind of falls flat. Is like I don't even want my wife to have a public Instagram. I, I think that yeah. in itself well, we is also. Well, started there. Well, I mean, it, it, this is why this is a good segment because, I mean, she can get rid of it, you know. <laughs> but as of now, yeah, this is not disqualifying. She's fine, you know. But you know, I've noticed that a lot of girls, when they get attached to that sort of dopamine that they get from the internet, it becomes really addicting. Like when they, especially when you get you went through a breakup and immediately you dyed your hair and went to Instagram, and started posting I pictures. Went crazy, yeah. Girls supplement. <laughs> A man's love with Instagram. So once they get kind of used to that attention, it's hard for that that itch to go away. It's a, it's like a coke addiction. Yeah. Okay, Fresh. Can I ask a question to you? No. Wait, him. You mean you mean you mean fit? Fit. My bad. Oh, okay. I okay. She was said first. So I was like, uh, what? What? Uh, okay, but okay. How do you feel about guys who take, <laughs> like, who take their women's pictures of them in bikinis and allow them to post it? <laughs> a lot of time is coke. <laughs> the woman has more leverage and sexual market value than him, so he's kind of her photographer, and he's got to do it. Stick on the on. So you don't. Okay, I'll take it. That's the reality. Because if you, you if you if you put him in a silent room and said, "Hey, man, would you prefer she don't post the show on the internet?" They'd be like, "Yeah." I'd you wouldn't want to show your girl off. Yeah, there's some guys that like to do that. Yeah. Not on the internet to random people, man. Neon, do you take your girls' photos? Uh, yeah, a lot of them. Yeah. You are you proud of that? Yeah, uh, you know, I, I you know make sure to get the angles bro, right. You are changing when you get older, man. You're gonna be like, what the fuck, man? Sheesh! What do okay. you think about me, bro? Me? Yeah. Doesn't matter. I think you're a kid. I mean, I am a kid. Like, yeah. yeah true.